All right, all right. So, what's up, YouTube? I'm gonna start a new YouTube video. I just got a new phone. What's up, Steve? Say what's up. What's up? All right. So, here's my question. We were, we were just talking about this. It's a weird topic, but you know, y'all feel me. Y'all comment and shit. You let me know what you think. All right. You know how? You know how? Wait, well, give, give me a second. I'm gonna talk. But you know how? What's up, Tina? What's up, man? What's gravy, boy? What's gravy, my boy? Yes, sir. All right, so my question is, you know how Halloween masks are a thing. Mom, I have a question. You're a doctor. All right, almost. so almost. almost. Um, pretty Not much quite. a doctor. Not so quite. my question is, Yes. me and Steve are having a debate. Okay. Not really a debate. We just. Can we roll while we talk? Yes. I'm going to want to leave to go visit Mom. Here. Yes, ma'am, of course. All right, so the debate is. And this is kind of a weird question. Please don't ask us how we get on this topic. Trust me, I've heard and seen it all. <coughs> all right. So you know how people wear Halloween masks mm -hmm. and it's just like sitting on top of their face. Mm -hmm. And you know how a human face is just a face. Mm -hmm. Essentially, it's like the mold of a mask. Mm -hmm. What if, if I was, and I'm not planning on doing this or anything. If I was to cut a person's face off. Mm -hmm. And I put said face on top of my face. Mm -hmm. There would be skin on the bottom side of it, right? Mm -hmm. There would be tissue. There'd Not be the epidermis, but there would be tissue. All right. Yes. So, so we have an epidermis. We have an extra layer or whatever on the outside of us. We have a couple extra layers of skin. Mm -hmm. On the inside. We have three layers of skin. Okay. Oh, thick skin. I get that expression now. Okay. So, here is my other question. You cut somebody's face off. You, you just cut it off. Mm -hmm. You put that face on your face. Mm -hmm. You could essentially wear it as a mask, correct? Yes. All right. If I was to cut someone's, if I was to behead somebody, like mm -hmm. shoulders, mm -hmm. and I know our skulls are the different sizes and shit. If mm -hmm. I cut their whole shit off, could I lift off their skin from their, like, pull their skull out uh, with their whatever little pieces of vertebrae that'll still be in there because i know it's not a solid i can't just pull it out like a broomstick mm -hmm. but you know i just get the whole thing out would i be able to in turn boozy watermelon swishes are out that's pretty dope oh because i had the boozy other kind y'all get that but so you're asking me if you cut off somebody's head could you take off their skin from their skull and put it on you yes to wear as a mask to wear yes, as a mask like and you're... that's not the end of the question that that's just the part two of the question that that's the ne that's the next question to see if the third thing would even be valid that's like foot in the door is it valid yes with a whole lot of other stuff involved but the the simple answer is yes you could cut off somebody's skin from their face and wear it as a mask all right yes. and my third and final question yes could you essentially since you can cut someone's face off or whatever and put that on could you wear someone's whole all right you know how you wear people you know how you wear clothes that are you know how you and your homies share like a t-shirt or something you feel me could you is it possible that a person okay okay when you wear somebody else's t-shirt if it fits you it fits you uh -huh. if it's too big it's baggy uh -huh. if it's a little bit too small you can fit it you just have to st stretch it on uh -huh. if a person i'm six foot two if a person i'm not ever planning on doing this if i kill someone, uh -huh. cut their fucking feet open, cut the bottom of their feet off, and then skin them from fucking ankle to motherfucking ankle. Uh -huh. Just straight up the middle like it's a goddamn onesie. Uh -huh. Here you go, here's that blunt seed. And I just put that on. I could, would it stretch like clothes? Would it Would it stretch like a onesie that is maybe a size too small? Or would it, would clothes, no. look, here's what we were wondering, would skin look, rip? Look, no, look, look, all right. Cause, it all wouldn't right, stretch? Is, it wouldn't stretch. Okay, that's, you have to that find was our somebody question. somebody of the same size. You could not, and that's what like, you were take saying. my skin right. and, and put that on my body. put it on your body. No, right, that's right. That does not function like that. Okay, um, all right. And then, because what we were saying was, he was, he was, yeah, because he, when he was asking about, like, could, like, could we wear it as a mask? I was going to say, 
there's not there's not really procedures for like surgery. I mean, I guess you could, but if you were to do it at home and put it on his face, like it wouldn't. But yeah, if you were to like, like straight be, up put no, somebody else, right. it wouldn't look it right. Would, but you could. You could. It wouldn't look. It, right. That's what I. Yeah, that's what I was saying. It just wouldn't it look, would look right. Weird. It, would it look looks look like super you weird. Cut somebody's face off and wore like that's the only. Yeah, that's what it looked like. Yeah, right. It wouldn't conform. Okay. To your bones but that's what I. That's what I was wondering. Like another. But if I had. Because we were. Because I was also wondering because that made face off. Like I know was just a movie but if not saying all right well they can do that now they can transplant that's another face. question if we have the same shape face if me and steve's had the same shape face no, we don't i'm not i'm not black good. no but, I, I, but that already, that doesn't that matter if we're I'm black and it doesn't matter if it if it'll look right i'm saying if we have the same facial but shape with same cheekbones and ears normal i know okay. it wouldn't look normal yeah, yeah like especially right that's somebody victims, else's yeah accident victims yep. that have had like you know partial acid well like people that have had acid thrown on them yeah like when they go and they usually in situations like that they will graft your own skin yeah to put skin it on you. they don't use somebody else's tissue because there's rejection because you've seen you i got i got burnt freshman year my house burnt down okay and that's what that's what all this is or whatever okay. and my chest was burnt pretty well and they were actually going to I, we opted not to, but they were they were going to they were because when I was younger it was way bad it was way worse mm -hmm. it, it, it looks a lot better than it is now, mm -hmm. but uh I mean it looks a lot better now but um they were planning on they were trying to graft my skin and mm -hmm. shit and I was just like uh I mean look I'm cool with the way I mean it happens it's just life it's a part of my story I'd rather have a few burn scars or whatever than have it, it'll look like a like I have a huge and patch, and it'll it'll then they'll try to blend it or whatever, mm -hmm. but you can really tell it'll be, mm -hmm. it'll be very different. It would be and, well over time. Not, it would heal. Sorry. Oh no, go ahead. Over, over time, it would heal, and it would look more normal. Right. Than when you first do it. Right. But yes, I mean, skin from your thigh or your abdomen is a different type very of skin different. than yeah. the skin on your neck. Especially because like I got burnt like like around like mm -hmm. it, it happened to my whole neck so mm -hmm. if i got they're not gonna fucking graft a whole neck skin like well, they, i'm gonna just cut off the whole bits and they <laughs> probably have done at that point in time they probably would have done bits and pieces like yeah the front first and then the back or vice right. versa vice, you yeah. have to allow for healing time right and your body not to go in shock <coughs> See that that I don't know why me and we were just having that conversation, and I, I I thought that was a good topic of discussion or whatever. So I I started recording so I can go back later and look at that. But I um the first video I'm gonna show you later, and we're discussing it in the car, and we're we're making some pretty straight points. I didn't start recording till we got like right up the street, or else the whole conversation when we started off on just the face, going to the whole body. Like, okay. I have one more question. Mm -hmm. I, I'm just full of questions right now. That's so. fine. All right, you cut you cut this shit off. You cut this shit off. And like like cut like we said, what shit off? I'm, so, I'm sorry. <laughs> what I'm sorry. We cut this shit off. At the position, you like, what, what? <laughs> this shit hurts. Like what shit? <laughs> like, what? what? <laughs> but um, if I cut above the collarbone, okay. or actually right right beneath the collarbone, <laughs> so it'll be a full. Well, I need to be able to move you, my shoulders. I think I know where you're going with this. Right. If you were to cut all of this off. And just slide that shit off. Hair and, and all. Well, you wouldn't just be able to slide it off because there's all kinds of ligaments and tendons. All right, and so I'd have to go in right. and... If you cut all of that off, would you be able just to slide it over your head like Would a I be able to no. cut this man's head off right now? With his beard and hair and put that shit on me right now? You... No. I mean... Ew. We were saying it would stink like shit. Ew. It would be the worst smell ever. No, it would just, it would you just, you'd just, have no. to cure it. It, 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 it would literally you look like, it. It, no, you, it'd physically be impossible because. That's the thing, physically. I want to know, is it physically even possible? No. 
It's not. The it's only not. way you and can do that is cut the front portion of somebody's face off and wear it. That's and the wear best. It. And yeah. wear it. That's the best. You wouldn't be able to just no. That's the best okay. you can get. Impossible. It's just cutting somebody's face just around here, just the mm -hmm. front of their face. That's the only thing. Okay. You can and do. Like two little holes in the sides for string another, and wear. It. That's, that's literally, that. literally, I made the string reference whenever I was talking about like like that's all I saw yeah. was just a face with a string tied in the back with a bunny ear. It would look weird. It looks super weird. It would look super weird it really would because of everything you have to treat the skin okay because you've seen shrunken heads right yes i have so seen if you heads. don't that's what happens whenever you don't specifically treat skin is it shrivels and dies that's but nick is really because those so shrunken heads are really from it's, people yeah they're just not they're real people's people. heads right. i always thought they were like little this is, i always people. thought they were like little oompa loompa type shits but well they, i mean pygmies do <laughs> exist <laughs> Right. In the Amazon jungle. I'm, I'm sorry. Like I don't know. That was probably people. a fucking offensive term. I'm no. sorry if I have any little smaller people. I don't know why I did little that. People. I don't know if I have any little people watching, little people. but. I'm but sorry. um, but no, those are from real. Those are from real people who have died that they have preserved the skin, and treated it with like formaldehydes and things like that. But over time, especially because they sit them out in the sun. It, it deteriorates and shrinks. See, formaldehyde is a formaldehyde is weird to me. It's like, is it just embalming? Is that? That's embalming. And my girl actually just graduated from funeral director school, so she had to do that's all cool of as that. fuck. See, I could I couldn't embal. I'm all sorry about that. that. She told me like little secrets, <clears throat> like they have to um, they have to glue the eyes shut because sometimes there's leakage. Oh yeah, because there's your eyes are just yeah. Well, I mean they're liquid, they're water. full of fluid, right? Yeah. So when you die, where does that fluid go? You know, you can drain it. Do people really people people fluid. really defecate and shit on themselves? Absolutely. That's crazy. Absolutely. Because like you got you still got shit in your body whenever I mean like it's, it's just a, your body release and everything. I know, that's like, that's just crazy to me yep. though. It's like it's like that's something that's a part of death that you don't really think about. Like. Like, you shit on long yourself. That's like, what that line came yeah, from. Yeah, yeah. Like, when, he, when he kills you, when he kills you, you gonna shit on yourself. You are gonna lose. Body. I mean, it doesn't ha like it doesn't happen immediately. Like if somebody kills you, like yeah. if you get shot in the heart and you're dying, it right. doesn't mean you're automatically going. To <laughs> Oh man, that shit would suck if you survived. But as oh, I'm done. time goes on, if those, if that fecal matter or that urine isn't extricated Taking from out. the body, it's gonna come out. It's going to come out because there's no more sphincter control. Everything mm. just relaxes and loosens. Right, because it's, so it's a dead body. It's... It all comes out. There's Damn. nothing holding it in anymore. I'm learning a lot of shit today, y'all. Huh? Yeah. Let me see if I have any more good questions. <laughs> I'm going to think, because look, look, we, look, this debate was so good. And that's the end of this one. Y'all have a good day.